Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to create this 3D black bars effect instead of after effects. Alright, so here's the clip I'm working with. As you can see, there are no black bars or some people call them like letter boxes, but I'm just going to call them black bars for this tutorial. But yeah, so there's no black bars or anything here. Um, but what we want to do first is rotoscope. Like I usually do in most of my tutorials is just rotoscoping. So what you want to do is make sure you have the rotoscoping selection thing here selected and then double click on your layer and it should bring up another like viewing composition kind of layer here and we just want to make this pretty big so we can see what we're doing and before we get started we just want to make sure that we are on the first frame and also our quality is at full just so we get the best results in our uh, masking here and we just want to make a rough selection around the minion here it did a pretty good job uh, around the edges kind of messed up on the road here so if you hold alt on your keyboard uh, at the same time while just like left clicking it will actually like remove your selection so kind of a nice tip to use while you're selecting your stuff but what we want to do up here in the quality is change this to best just so you have the best uh, quality of your rotor brush here and we just want to go frame by frame making sure the rotor brush does not mess up i'm just gonna speed up this because i think the rotor brush does a pretty good job and even around the edges here it's not going to really matter uh because the letterbox does not go that high up on the frame there we go we reached the end and all looks pretty good but what we want to do is change our feather to just around like 15 or something and you can see like the edge here is just smoother and maybe turn on motion blur yeah motion blur looks a lot more natural all right so now we just want to freeze our rotor brush all right, our rotor brush just finished freezing so we can close our layer here. And now we are back to our main composition. And as you can see, it's rotor brushed out like normal when you rotor brush stuff. But we wanna duplicate this layer, hit Control D on your keyboard. Now we have two layers. And at the bottom, we just wanna delete the rotor brush. Let's get rid of that. So now we have a rotor brush on the top. And the next thing we wanna do to create those like black bars is we wanna create a new uh, solid. So going up here, the layer new solid and just have the default settings and make sure your color is black here and type in effect called CC Jaws. Drag this onto your layer here and make sure it is on your black solid that we just created. And we want to make our completion here to like 80 and make our height zero. So now we have the black bars on the edges here, the bottom and top. But as you can see, he is still behind the bars and he's not actually in front of them. So to fix this, we want to bring our black solid between our layers here. Now, when we play this back, you can see that is giving like a 3D effect that you have seen in the Lyrical Lemonade video. Now it's up to you, but what you can do is make it so this black bar on the top is actually still like uh, making it so the minion is behind it and not actually uh, composed in the back here so what i'm going to do is select this black solid here and we're just going to go up to the pen tool or actually the rectangle tool works better for this and we just want to select our bottom uh bar here so now it's only the bottom and not the top but to fix that and to get the top back we would just want to duplicate our black solid Control d bring this above the minion clip here and now you can go back to your arrow like selection tool and hit M on your keyboard for your mask. And like, you wanna like make sure you're selecting this like corner right here. And just drag this up to where you can see our top bar here. And now when we play this back, you can see that only the bottom is now being affected with this like rotoscope and the top is still being like uh, composed how it used to be before we had the rotor brush layer uh, flipped up. So now if we just like turn off these layers here you can kind of see how this effect turned out and it turned out pretty cool in this uh, little minion shot here uh, but obviously you can do this for any other clip or any subject you want to do this for hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial it was pretty simple but i think it puts off a kind of cool effect that you don't usually see in music videos or just videos in general so have fun experimenting with this effect and if you guys learned something new make sure to drop a like subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below uh, for different tutorials that you guys want to see in the future and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out